In this video we will talk about buy stop order. This is another kind of uh, pending order. And again, a life example. Let's say you are analyzing, uh, analyzing charts and you can see that the price came up after some uh, big news, there was a huge gap. The price came up to here, that was the highest point. Then it dropped and now it's going up again. And it's quite close to the previous high. And your belief is that once, once the price will go, uh, go higher than this, uh, than these tops, previous tops, it will continue going up. But you don't have time to wait for that. You are a busy businessman and you just want to set the pending order that will be waiting there and execute your idea uh, once the market uh, reach, reaches this point. You can do it in a couple of ways. First one is to go to new order, pending order, and the third one from the top is the buy stop order. You set the buy stop, you can, of course, first you need to know what was the top, so you can check it over here. Uh, it's 12.076, uh, so 12.076. Seventy-six. Uh, I always add the spread up to that. So let's say I've got uh, twenty spreads. So I will replace seven with nine and place. And once the price will uh, will go higher than the stops, my uh, buy stop order will be triggered, and I will be in the game. I can see my trade uh, over here. So the rule for that is that the price that you want to buy buy has to be higher than the actual buy price. So we've got always two prices, one is the sell, one is buy, and it has to be higher than, uh, than this one. Another way of placing this order is if you want to do it quicker uh, without going to the dialog and typing any numbers, let's delete this one. You can just uh, go over here, right click and go to trading and you've got the buy stop. So you just press the buy stop, now it's set, uh, it's set to 3 lots. Uh, when I press it, it will be a 3 loss. If I'm not happy with 3 loss, I want to change it. I go over here, this little triangle, and I change this 3 loss to, I don't know, let's say I want to trade 5 loss. I want to go crazy. Uh, I just press trading, buy stop, and now it's set to 5. So I set 5, and there it is. There's my order, uh, if I click a little bit too high or something or too low, I can always manipulate it over here uh, by just dragging it or uh, double clicking here and I can, I can change the numbers as well. And then just press modify and it will be modified. And that's it. So remember, the price needs to be higher than the actual price of the market to place the buy stop and if you want to see some other videos please subscribe to my channel and I will be placing a lot of interesting videos if you've got, you've got any ideas just let me know uh, and I will uh, make videos about that good luck with your trading you what is a sell stop order and how to place it. So sell stop order is uh, another option